At the Kerala livestock market in East Ababa, a crushed truck rests with the animals in the feedlot. No one is injured and the animals don't seem to mind the commotion. Sheep and goat meat are an integral part of Ethiopian cuisine. The animals also have cultural value for the dominant Christian population as well as for the Ethiopian Muslims. I bought the sheep for about a thousand beer to enjoy before we start fasting again for Lent. People who have cars take their animals home in a car. Those who live far might transport their animal in a taxi. Those who live nearby can walk their animals home and sometimes the butcher will come with them to slaughter the animal in their home. Ethiopians have a strong tradition of bringing live animals home to be slaughtered. The culture, however, presents a challenge because of the country's poor infrastructure. They are though still clinging on this tradition, but experts argue the tradition poses health risks. Slaughtering sheep at home may be important for the, from the cultural perspective, but uh, from hygienic perspective, it is not, it is not recommended. So uh, the municipality would like to discourage slaughtering at home, but rather at abattoirs, and also buy slaughtered sheep carcass from supermarkets. That is, uh, I think that's going to be a trend. Yeah. It is estimated there are around 25 and a half million sheep and 25 million goats in Ethiopia. The animals are the major livestock earning export for the country, with around nine abattoirs exporting to the Middle East. <laughs> 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 <laughs>